How's it going, mini lads out here? And welcome back to Ultimate Driving out here inside of the Westover Islands. And today, we're gonna be showing you of all UD Edition cars except limited editions and about for many of the vehicles as well. As you can see, for about for the filters and about for recommended for you, for all vehicles itself, cars for millions or hundreds of thousands of them prices as well. So, let's gonna be pride to choose for you the addition cars of all. Starting in Mercedes AMG for like this thing. Starting in AMG vehicle like despite seeing this. This is absolutely I'm just gonna be awaiting for. The top speed is 185 miles per hour, 0 to 60 is 4.2 seconds rewards per mile, and the price 136,000 credits in cash. Because I'm about to look at this vehicle, and because this is absolutely legalized edition. Because UD editions are absolutely legalized, because I'm pretty wanted to buy for this vehicle for sure. Even though I'm just gonna be trying to purchase one vehicle at a time, if I already purchase of this vehicle, that let me drive in the back for this, that total play in the back for this game. It's not my game for the back for this thing. That is someone's game for the back for this one, and the UD edition is absolutely called Mercedes for the C63 AMG in the back for this one, because if that let me know down in the comments that I just probably used it, this vehicle. I'm pretty sure that we're gonna be using some kind of many more tires or not even probably sure that I just gonna be using for this vehicle. Not for now and because that is pretty that I just wanted to buy some vehicles or street racing vehicles like Need for Speed Unbound and Need for Speed Heat. Now looks like even for the vehicle itself looks pretty legalized and not submitted to banned in the US. Now the next one is the Mazda RX-7 UD Edition and what do you think it's not the Red Sun's vehicle by the way the top speed is 185 miles an hour 0 to 60 will be here in 4.6 seconds which is more slower than it's absolutely gonna be doing for just like this rewards per mile 647 and the price is 130,000 credits in cash as you can look at this vehicle and about for their legal styles, the Red Sun's RX-7's rear diffuser and about for this one, the rear bumper and some kind of the body kits or wide bodies like their rears and covers and about their rear tires because looks like this is actually some kind of Need for Speed Unbound reference or Midnight Club street racing vehicle. And there must be a rear spoiler onto the back and is absolutely some kind of red suns around here or the GT spoiler is literally gonna be doing the headlights is absolutely pretty a little bit one thing and because the real thing is you should not able to buy for this vehicle or you want it if you're a bad guy of this game you try to ever try to buy for this vehicle and street race against their other kinds of professional vehicles and against their highest top speed and most expensive vehicles in this game probably I shouldn't have been able to buy for this vehicle because probably I wouldn't have been able to get saw by the police and probably I wouldn't have been able to buy for this vehicle because I'm just always choosing for a stock car championship it's modificationable and this is actually legalized vehicle for sure and it's ridiculously awesome and probably the same top speed goes to Mercedes. And now it's absolute also for $130,000 or probably 130,000 credits in cash is the, the Subaru BRZ GR for a bath for just win. The brand new BRZ, the top speed is gonna be for 160 miles per hour. It's more slower than ever for well, 185 miles per hour. It's not very good. And almost really fast as 0 to 60 as 4.3 seconds. It is absolutely slower than for the Mercedes C63 acceleration. Probably we're gonna be viewing the back of this vehicle. Need for speed unbound reference. 
by using of this vehicle, replaced it of this vehicle with our GT86 GR. The new BRZ is absolutely going to be the same, it's not the same, probably it's going to be doing for such as copycat as well. The copycat is going to be to do like this one and looks like the rear view as this one, the rear wing is absolutely some kind of need for speed heat reference and the front splitter is absolutely way more bigger side skirts body kits and probably that sounds legalized and if this is actually is look like a various legalized vehicle it's perhaps this is something is ridiculously so legalized whatsoever more than ever like need for speed unbound reference and the next is for the Nissan 240SX like this one or probably this is actually gonna be to do like this one and it's a top speed is 136 miles per hour almost 5 seconds for the 0 to 60 is under 5 seconds will be 4.9 seconds rewards per mile and the price is 65,000 for about for this thing 65,000 credits in cash but look how of this vehicle probably need for speed reference the front bumper or the headlights should be Chevy Camaro like this in the front headlights 240SX modification mode in the back for its front like the Honda NSX around for here with thousands the hood here side skirts and probably some kind of a 1980s vehicle the rear bumper and the rear tail lights is gonna be to do like this one tail lights and the rear bumper looks like some kind of a Nissan S13 the rear spoiler as well and the rims not so pretty good as well but even legalized as well probably not the fastest vehicle or probably the fastest street racing vehicle you ever saw in the back of this one but you can't purchase if you just try to do purchase vehicle because if you're a bad guy of this game probably you're prohibited to reach 200 miles per hour even because of this only one for stabilization for the UD edition so let's switch all the way for UD editions from recommended to you to rank ups as well so not all the vehicles that we probably re very saw the most fifth thing is the BMW M3 GTR as well. Let's just gonna be a race view. The top speed is about for 242 miles per hour. That's faster than McLaren F1. The 0 to 60 in miles per hour time is 1.6 seconds rewards per mile and a half a thousand thirteen hundred dollars or credits in cash. And the rank should be 325 but this is not the price as well as you can look at the graph with this one need for speed most wanted turns into a NASCAR vehicle perhaps it's the BMW M3 GTR and it's an official UD edition vehicle as well and perhaps even looking like this one it's pretty awesome and I should be rather to drive this car right now and before we get to the end of this video there are not of unofficial UD vehicles as well and because of their limited of the UD edition vehicles that's not ever to try to do so not any more of the UD editions comes to limited editions around for many more vehicles but I'm sorry that it's just literally missing around from here of any more of these UD editions and about their self was the Toyota Mitsubishi and Honda we're not gonna be into this situation about here there are off-sale UD edition cars where Honda Toyota and Mitsubishi including the Ford Mustang Fox body so even because it's absolutely gonna be going for around here the Fox body isn't gonna be for just using for a little bit for many of little bit itself for about here there are no new vehicles out here because when it comes out I have currently under 1.5 million credits in cash because it looks like I wasn't able to get for about for new vehicles in the Balfour this way so even about for the electric cars were not UD additions 
so including whatever for Japanese debut vehicles were slightly everywhere so no Italian vehicles for some kind of UD additions including some kind of a race cars as well UD's additions about for Italian Lamborghinis Ferraris being removed is nothing as well except Ferraris that still have because Lamborghinis got removed including the UD additions as well and I shouldn't able to get there back and we don't know how to get many cars there's no Lamborghinis back and there's nothing that we can do so including some kind of a Japanese cars uh, that there is not any more of the UD edition vehicles as well so probably this is where we're gonna be end of this video without further notices unofficials of the UD editions I cannot believe this isn't gonna be going all of the cars and for ourselves that even many more of these vehicles except that so this is the end of the video for just uh, all the way for many more of this vehicle and what about in my garage and there must be one UD edition left there must be a Toyota Prius which is a official UD edition and I just bought this vehicle for a level 30 as this vehicle it must be for a stock Prius a hybrid vehicle or the hybrid car of course and about for just ourselves that currently the vehicle is only white but looks like the vehicle is slightly using in about the color white as well the rims looks like high British for just about here for about like this well everything is absolutely pretty good about using Toyota Prius and there is one thing in about for this feature the big spoiler in the rear must be some kind of McLaren 650s GT3 spoiler in the back as well so probably this is something is slightly dumb of course and the splitter or front like this one the side skirts and the diffuser isn't something is gotta be legal as well the front splitter is too small or likely itself or just gonna be in the front as well so anyways that is the end of this video and it's about over seven minutes and about for it's not an official quick video as well for like this one the top speed is 125 miles per hour and that should be the slowest vehicle of UD edition cars as well this is the slowest UD edition car that I ever seen which is only one conclusion but unless unfortunately that doesn't matter about for the top speed isn't right as well and because to realize the top speed should be 115 miles per hour and worst of all I couldn't able to get raised for a top speed the rank 30 has finally required front wheel drive and 0 to 60 is 5 seconds that was literally disappointed as well and that is all the UD cars as well for the UD edition cars and I didn't admit to claim for this vehicle at all so thanks for watching in the back for this video and for all your support in the back for this only one thing and that is all the UD edition vehicles but not exactly except one so probably free vehicles limited edition times and whatever that doesn't gonna be literally try to exist one but probably and that is all try to do so I guess if you like or don't like of this video just leave a like or give me a like or subscribe on this channel and click that bell for some more notifications thanks for watching and for all your support and you probably would you like them if you try to drive of all UD edition cars or I just try to buy all the UD edition cars I won't be able to buy for this vehicle until you let me know down in the comments that I should have been able to buy for this one or buying for just screwing up all UD edition cars and probably my data wasn't gonna be even enough to do so thanks for watching and for all your support once again that I just actually said and this is gonna be Turbo Concept is signing off right now and perhaps I'm gonna be seeing you in Minilands all later.